would you talk to your kids like this? Queen. What's the tea? No. What's the tea? Stop. What's up, bro? What's up? How'd you sleep? Good. Calm, calm. No capping? No capping? No. Peak. Happy how was your lunch? It was good. Yeah? yeah. It was bussing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just quick vibe check. How, how are you feeling? Quick vibe oh check. Oh my god. Stop. <laughs> so, uh, that is Michael Fasolo. Um, he calls himself Millennial Parent. Like, I guess, me and you are, Hannah. Um, but his kids are slightly... <laughs> <laughs> I know, but but uh, his kids are slightly older than ours, um, 12 and 16, um, and this video got over a million views, 1.3 million views. Now, I admit, I don't understand half the words that he's using. I don't think he does. <laughs> <laughs> but he does either. His, his kids certainly do, and their reactions to it are brilliant. Um, they That's it. cringe and then kind of accept reluctantly he's just winding them up. Um, and he... Um, He's told Newsweek um, that he's, he feels it's his job to embarrass the kids. Um, some of these phrases I've never heard of. Slay queen, slap. I haven't heard of that one. I hadn't heard of slap, slay queen. Yeah, not that anyone's ever used that. I don't even know if it would be a compliment or not, actually. But anyway, no one's ever used um, it directly to me, but I have heard it. What's um, the tea? I've heard of that. I've heard what's of going peak, on? Peak, definitely. But I always, I, I always thought peak was supposed to be um, kind of like, you know, like, like the best, the top, the the, the most yeah. updated. And I don't think it is. I think it's just kind of like good, okay, average. Oh, okay. I mean, I don't know. I might be wrong. Let, let's see if anyone's listening. <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> um, what I love about it, okay, it's, it's generated lots of um, comments um, from other parents. Yeah. Um, what I love is some of them, one said, I do this to my kids all the time. They <laughs> hate me for it. Personally, I would say it's because I'm so penged. <laughs> Uh, and then someone else saying, I can't wait until mine are old enough to wind up like this. And I think both of us can agree that that is something to very much look forward to. Everyone has been putting putting me off the teenage years recently. I just feel like I've heard all these sort of horror stories. But the, op, the, the, the ability to be able to wind him up um, and just sort of take the mick out of him in a kind of like just embarrassing basically is, is really exciting. <laughs> I'm going to be an annoying mum on the sidelines yelling out all of this cool slang. <laughs> as long as Lewis doesn't say those kind of words on TV, yeah. when he's <laughs> news, I think it should be okay. I think we'll have um, to come on here if he ends up doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Going viral for using Peng on BBC News. 